subscribe my channel This year, South Quran has brought some really good new options that you can watch. Here are some lists that we've listed for the top 10 Korean drama in half of year of 2021. 10. Mad for each other. Mad for each other is a psychological drama that will air on May 24, 2021. This drama tells the story of Na Huyo played by Young Woo and Lee Min Kyung played by Oh Yun Se. Even though they have different backgrounds in life, they both have a lot in common. Huyo is a detective who works with the violent crime unit at the Gangnam Police, but he is known as a hot-tempered man who often can't contain his emotions. Whereas in the past, Min Kyung had a very perfect life, but Min Kyung's life changed after the accident that happened to her. She withdraws from her social life because she refuses to trust others. But as their relationship grows closer, slowly the two begin to heal themselves and fall in love with each other. 9. Mine. Mine is a Korean drama genre mystery thriller, which airs on May 8, 2021. This drama is a drama about strong and ambitious women who overcome society's prejudices to find what is truly theirs. Lee Bo Young plays So Hee Su, a former top actress and wife of the second son of Hyo Won Group's Jabol family. Kim Seo Hyun plays Yong Seo Hyun, a graceful wife born to Hyo Won Group's eldest son. The lives of the two daughters in law of this wealthy family are turned upside down when two new women arrive private tutor, Kang Ji Kyung and a young housekeeper, Kim Yu Yun. 8. Youth of May Youth of May is a drama with a sad story, combining a tragic love with the historical events of the Gwangju democratization movement that took place in May 1980. Tae Hee, played by Lee Doo Hyun, is a medical student of the famous genius, but he did not pass for another purpose in his life. He Tae meets Myung Hee, played by Go Min Si, a girl who worked as a nurse for three years and has dreams of going to college and living abroad. They seem destined to meet, and they both fall in love with each other, but circumstances make it impossible for them to be together. This drama has aired on May 3, 20, 21. 7. Law School Law School centers on four main characters, Yang Jong-hu, Han Jun-hui, Kang Sol-a, and Kim yoon suk The show takes place at Hankook University and features the professors and students in the law department. They are working together on an unusual case in which a law professor is indicted for murder. The series also covers how the characters face and overcome their own hardships, such as the death of a loved one, or an abusive relationship which are complex but life-changing experiences for each one of them. Law School have been aired on April 14, 2021 with 16 episodes. 6. Vincenzo It has countless reasons why this drama could be one of the best K-dramas on Netflix in 2021. Vincenzo is a dark comedy that has been aired in February 20, 2021. This is a drama about Vincenzo Cassano Song Jun Ki, a lawyer of Korean descent who grew up in Italy and works for the Mafia, as a consiglia. When he returns to Korea due to conflicts within his organization, he meets a beautiful lawyer, named Honacha Young Jen Yo Bin. In his escape, Vincenzo also has to face the evil businessman who runs the Babel Group, which has harmed many people including the residents of Jumba Plaza, where he lived while in Korea. 5. Beyond Evil Beyond Evil is a psychological thriller drama starring Yo Jin Gu and Shin Ha Kyung. 
This drama follows the story of a skilled former detective named Lee Dong Sik who is demoted from his rank and transferred to the Manyang police station located in the western part of Gyeonggi province. Even though life in the small town feels calm, Dong Sik admits that he is bored with his job. Her life slowly changes after the arrival of Detective Han Ju Won. The two of them become partners to solve serial murder cases, but often get into arguments because of differences in character. The drama has been released on February 19, 2021. 4. Ney Villera Ney Villera has a story that is both touching and heartwarming. The drama is one of the many Korean dramas based on the popular South Korean webtoon. It tells the story of Sim Deek Chul played by Park In Hwan, who is 70 years old and wants to pursue his dream as a ballet dancer. But, his decision was not approved by his wife and adult children. But that doesn't make Sim Deek Chul waver in pursuing his dream. He then enrolled in a ballet studio and learned the dance. There he meets Lee Chirok played by Song Kang a man who has a talent for ballet dancing. But because of the difficult times he was facing, his desire to dance slowly began to fade. 3. Mouse Mouse is one of the most talked drama this year, which carries the mystery thriller genre. This drama tells about the hunt for a super genius serial killer that is passed down through genes. A two-faced psychopath and a stubborn detective named Go Mukai, played by Lee Hee Joon, want to take revenge for the murder of his parents. Lee Soong Gi also take a part of this drama played as Yong Ba Ryu, a young and honest policeman, who always stands up for justice. They work together to chase down a serial killer in their town. 2. Move to Heaven This Korean drama directed by Netflix managed to attract a million attention. Move to Heaven succeeded in making the audience burst into tears. It tells the life of Ji Yu played by Tang Jun Sang, a 20-year-old young man who suffers from Asperger's syndrome. He runs the Move to Heaven business with his father as a trauma cleaner. However, one night his father had a heart attack and was pronounced dead. Ji Ru who has difficulty accepting change must adapt to the presence of his uncle sang played by Lee Chun's player, who become his guardian. 1. Taxi Driver Adapted from the popular digital comic by Carlos and Lee Jae Jin, with the original title, The Deluxe Taxi, The Taxi Driver series, is a drama you shouldn't miss. Taxi Driver is an action crime genre drama that tells the story of Kim Doogie played by Lee Chun. He is a former special forces officer. His mother was brutally murdered four years ago. Jang Sung Chul played by Kim Wai Sung also has a mother with the same tragic fate. The two of them unite in the rainbow taxi fleet to avenge the victims of crime who did not find justice. 